פרשת וישב, ראשון. In this very aliyah we found that Yaakov Avinu is doing what he's not supposed to do. He's causing jealousy. What happens in the story? ויראו אחיו כי אותו אהב אביהם מכל אחיו, וישנאו אותו ולא יכלו דברו לשלום. The brothers of Yosef get very jealous of him. They start hating him. What's the reason? ויראו כי אותו אהב אביהם מכל אחיו. They see that their father loves him more than anybody else. Not only that, he gives Yosef special ketonet pasim, which causes him also an extra feeling of jealousy. Therefore, Chazal tell us in Gemara Shabbat, Yud Amud Bet, לעולם אל ישנה אדם בינו בין הבנים. A person should never change anything between the children. Give anything more to one child over the other. שהרי בשביל משקל שני סלעים מילת לקטון הפסים שעשה יעקב ליוסף יותר משאר אחיו, נתקנאו בו אחיו. ונתגלגל הדבר וירדו אבותינו למצרים. Because of that ketonet pasim, because of that extra jealousy that the brothers had over Yosef, everybody, the entire Klal Israel, had to go down to Mitzrayim. That's what eventually happened. This is how severe it is. But interesting, that right afterwards, we see that Yosef starts dreaming dreams. And he tells those dreams to his brothers. וחלום עוד חלום ויספר אותו לאחיו. He tells them in front of his father as well. What does, father, what does the father, Yaakov, do? Vayigar bo aviv. Vayomer lo, avo navo, ani veimecha veachecha lishtachavot lecha arza? Is that possible? Why did he scream at him? He believed the dreams. Rashi says that Yaakov Avinu believed that the dreams will come true and he waited for it to come true. So why did he scream at him if that's the case? The reason is, Rashi says, Shaya metil sin alav. He was causing jealousy and hatred. So he wanted to come down the hatred of the brothers. Yaakov had a mission. Make sure that you don't do it anymore. It's not true. It's wrong what you're doing. Well, how didn't Yaakov, that understands right now that such things cause hatred and jealousy, didn't understand that very basic idea in the beginning, when he treated Yosef better than his brothers? It wasn't just a one-time event. It was ongoing. This is a very, very big question, and the answer is that we see that although the brothers felt the jealousy, Yaakov Avinu, when he treated Yosef more than his brothers, couldn't feel that because he was the one doing it. But when others do it, when Yosef does it to his brothers, he feels it and he knows it right away. We see that many times we are blinded by our actions when we can see them very clearly when others do the same. And this is a very big message. This is Avot HaKdoshim. It's hard to talk about the Avot HaKdoshim because they are Kodesh Kodashim. Obviously, when we talk about them, it's only with the messages that the Torah wants to teach us. Obviously, there's some things that are very, very thin over here that really went wrong. But a message that we can clearly see in the Torah that although Yosef was causing jealousy, Yaakov Avinu picked on that, but he didn't pick on what he was doing. Thank <laughs> you.